Questions do remain, but tonight the community gathered near the pier, some lighting candles to honor the man who was in that car. Michelle Wolf leads our broadcast tonight. A community coming together after tragedy. A number of people added signs and candles to an ever growing memorial on the 14th Street Pier. What started with a poem written on poster board grew into a place to reflect and pay respects. I just wanted to create something that let others know and as well as the family that there's others that care. Antonio Simmons spearheaded the memorial at the 14th Street Pier and on Friday, hours after the red Nissan Kicks was recovered, along with the deceased man inside, those passing by left candles and took a moment to pray. You never know who it really affects until it happens, sadly. This is a very caring community. Hannah Merck has watched recovery efforts throughout the week and tells us her heart goes out to the man's family. Try to put yourself empathetically in anybody else's shoes. The tragedy greatly affected Simmons, who said his friend's father took his own life after a struggle with mental health. I feel like it's not talked about as much. Simmons encourages those who are fighting a silent battle to seek help. That it's okay to talk about your issues. It doesn't make you any less human. The big message tonight, support one another, love one another, be kind to one another. In Virginia Beach, Michelle Wolfton on your side.